You guys are a wonderful young couple. I like you a great deal. You don't have any children, do you? Not yet. Hallelujah. Don't, don't say not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Only procreate after marriage. I know that's old school, but it works out better. Because you already made the commitment to one another, and then that's solid and stable, and you, and you hang on to that a little while and make sure it stays solid and stable. Then you bring other people into the world. But let me say that. <laughs> Y'all not ready to get married. Let me tell you why. You think it's going to fix the jealousy problem. Nah. Doesn't work. Never has. If she's got an issue, she's got to resolve that issue within herself. You can't fix it, and a ring won't fix it. She has to be confident, and, and it's not a matter of what he does or does not do. It's a matter of how secure you feel in yourself as a person. Mm -hmm. You have to feel safe and secure that if he does bop off one day, you'll be fine. It's not the it and end all of everything. You just have to trust yourself. And you have to be comfortable with who you are and be comfortable with the fact that you are quite enough for him. He's lucky to have you. And, and you're going to believe that he's got enough sense to know that. And until you feel that kind of comfort in your own skin, you're always going to be jealous, ring or no ring. Okay. He's not doing anything wrong. He had a rough transition, but you have to get over that by becoming more grounded in your own womanhood. That, that's that. Mm -hmm. And listen, if you think he's bad now with not doing anything around the house, marry him and you'll really not get anything done. Because, you know, well, hey, we're married. <laughs> I'm cool. I'm going I'm to kick back, and that's what that is.